，这个拍子。We import beverage, uh, healthy beverage, that one. Okay. So they do a machine learning AI recognition system. <laughs> We're, we're really happy to be here. It's our first event in Taipei, and I'd like to thank Taiwan Startup Stadium for helping to make this happen, and also KPMG. We couldn't do it without these two lead supporters for this event, our first event in Taiwan. So today we're going to have a fully packed program. We're going to start with uh, a keynote talk. And then we're going to do uh, what we have done in many other locations, which is our tech chats with entrepreneurs. Uh, these are one-on-one -on -one Q and A's uh, with a moderator. You talk about scale, you talk about team, you talk about talent, uh, you talk about ambition, uh, you talk about opportunities, failures, lessons learned, uh, and scale, and finally win, W-I-N, win. Uh, so th this is a really crucial part of our program, the tech chats with entrepreneurs. And of course, we couldn't do this without the venture investors and the angel investors as well. So we have a panel of local VCs, and then we have a panel of global VCs. And then finally, we're going to be wrapping up with the reception, which is going to be on the 83rd floor. And if you can figure out how to get from one elevator bank to another <laughs> elevator bank to get up to the 83rd floor, the drinks are on us. <laughs> So uh, we really welcome you here. Um, I wanted to also say thank you uh, to uh, the many supporters who have helped us organize this event and who have helped us promote this event and get the word out. So because we're all about community building, we're not only about content, but we're, ra we're about community building as well. So we have a number of groups here who have, that have helped. Alumvest is one. AAMA is another. Um, and then uh, a number of startup groups as well uh, who have helped us get the word out. Uh, so let me just jump to the slide so you'll see who all of them are. Um, okay, there we go. Uh, the Taiwan Tech Makers Association, MOX, the Hong Kong Business Angel Network, uh, PR Newswire, and uh, Startup Asia, and then Forbes, where I actually I write a weekly column on tech innovation. So um, I would like to also say a little bit of word uh, about Silicon Dragon. This is our fifth year of um, holding events in global technology hotspots. One of the reasons that we're in Taiwan is because we think it's a booming or a budding technology hotspot. It's been a tech hotspot for years, traditionally semiconductor in those areas, and now we think there's a whole startup boom that's happening here. And we're here to illustrate what's happening here with startups. And so without further ado, I would like to welcome our first speaker uh, to, oh, and also I wanted to mention, if I know Twitter is not all that popular here, <laughs> but if you do tweet, uh, please tweet about the event at Silicon Dragon, and you can send your photos there as well. Uh, we have a Facebook page. And of course, Taiwan Startup Stadium has a Facebook page, so you can post photos there. And we're going to be sharing out all the video and all the photos with our network after the event. Uh, and if you haven't signed up for our newsletter, you'll be able to see some of the coverage in our newsletter as well, as well as the Forbes column. So OK, that's a little bit about us. Um, now, I would also like to welcome Anita to the stage to say a few remarks. Anita from Taiwan Startup Stadium. Thank you, Rebecca. And uh, thank you, everyone. So my name is Anita, and I run the Taiwan Startup Stadium. Uh, with the support of NDC National Dev Development Council, we started uh, TSS about 10 months ago, uh, for some of you that may not know, just exactly as what Rebecca points out, uh, somewhat Taiwan is remembered as a tech hub 
uh, you know, for manufacturing, um, producing phones and PCs and laptops. And we are pretty much in the junction and our effort is trying to actually make that transition and support the entrepreneurs that are brave enough to actually leap job uh, for the next generation, the internet uh, driven economy. And also, that's also our passion to increase and raise the awareness of Taiwan entrepreneurs in the world. So we've been actually been joking that uh, we've been the export department of Taiwan, Taiwan entrepreneurs in the past 10 months or so. And today, really, really happy, especially this is a fairly uh, investor-focused event. And uh, I want to say if we can actually collectively create and raise the KPI of you know, injecting more investment into our early stage startups and support their growth, uh, expand into regional and international markets, uh, that's really you know, somewhat a collective KPI if I could invite all of you to participate. Um, so Rebecca and I have conversation probably back almost a month, uh, a year ago, about bringing Silicon Dragon to Taipei. Uh, you know, we've been watching and following her work through the region and actually cross continents about putting together the communities of investors, entrepreneurs, talking about leading trends and really uh, how to actually uh, move forward for each of the distinct tech hubs. And we hope Taiwan, Taipei, would be you know a more distinct tech hub in the years to come, and that's where our efforts are putting into. So very happy to have Silicon Dragon here and all the partners who helped make this happen, and all of you who actually made it here today. So thank you for your participation. Thank you, Anita. Uh, now I would like to introduce Samuel Ah from KPMG. Uh, to come up and make a few uh, welcoming remarks as well. We've worked with KPMG in multiple locations, Sydney, Bangalore, Silicon Valley, um, Beijing, uh, Shanghai, uh, where else? Uh, London, Israel. Uh, so here is our inaugural event with KPMG in Taiwan. And Samuel is very much involved in technology sector. And so uh, Samuel, uh, please uh, welcome. Thank you, Rebecca. Good afternoon. My name is Samuel from KBMG. Uh, welcome to Taipei 101 and KBMG. We are at the same building up here. So uh, today is our pleasure to sponsor Silicon Dragon in this event. Uh, before this, KBMG exactly worked with Silicon Dragon in many other countries. As a professional accounting firm, we do understand how important for a startup company to have the support from the angel investor and the, and the other aligned partner. So in the, uh, two years ago, KPMG uh, built up our own startup support team, uh, and we worked with many um, uh, startup platforms and government units and the university innovation center to help the young people from different perspectives, uh, including accounting and finance, legal and business development. In the last two years, I'm happy to see we have our own ecosystem of startup company in Taiwan, and, I, and many young talent, they are noticed by the investor, not only in Taiwan, also in the US, Japan, and, and the US. I think today is a very good opportunity for the Taiwan company to know what happened in Silicon Valley right now, and to, to know the people they are looking for to work in the future. Um, in the future, I look forward to seeing more and more opportunity uh, for matching the Taiwan and US uh, investor and entrepreneurs like today's event. Uh, once again, thank you for being here and enjoy the event. Thank you. Well, thank you, Samuel, very much.